Welcome. I would like to talk to you and give you a deep dive in a topic which, uh, which maybe is going to change the way you re view your production planning and the way you do your machining tasks. We're going to talk about acceleration. We're going to talk about speeding up, keeping the same level of quality, actually even exceeding it. So what does speed and quality bring us? Just an increase in productivity. How is this all achieved? Well, by using and integrating robots in our Cinemeric CNC. First of all, I think you're familiar with the Siemens approach, where we offer uh, products from product design, machine concept, all the way to services. If we talk about integrating robot in the production planning and in the, in the processing, we, of course, are at product execution or machine operation. Why? Because integrating robots is not just useful for the end customer, but it can be also a benefit for the OEM, the machine tool builder. Let's have a look on how production used to be done or is still being done on a large scale today. So we have our machine tool controlled by the Cinemeric and the machine operator. What does the, what does the machine operator do? He loads and unloads the machine tool, and to save time and increase some sort of productivity, he takes, he takes the workpiece to some certain working cell where he does some manual uh, after-work preparation in the sense of polishing or deburring small tasks just to increase productivity. Well, is this productive? And customers said, OK, this is not the maximum of productivity we can achieve. So because of this, they integrated robots. So if you think about robots next to the machine tool, probably your mind wanders towards handling workpiece or, or tools. Why did the end customer do this? Well, they did this because the robot offers flexibility, he offers quality, and he, they wanted to increase productivity. But in the end, the robot just, just brought the workpiece to a certain working location, where again, the operator had to do some, some manual work. The question is, is this the optimum productivity we can achieve? only thing about robots as handling robots. Well, this is the image you might have known. You have your machine tool and your robot going inside the machine tool, taking the quadcopter or workspace, taking it out. What I want you to do is think about also the next step. Think about this phase, where the robot is also machining. So you, the robot has a spindle. He does, he does the machining tasks just to save time, because the machine tool works, let's say, 20 minutes, if you can reduce by five minutes the work of the machine just because the robot is taking some tasks over, you win five minutes of your production. Now, of course, some of you might think, OK, this might be a bit too complex now at the moment. Because I have a robot, I have a machine tool, I have to think of both. Well, you don't have to. Because with Cinemeric and Run My Robot, we offer you the single point of operation. Single point of operation means you have the Cinemeric CNC controlling the machine tool as well as the robot. And by using this, only having your knowledge of the CNC, you can use the complete functionality and compensation cycles, programming, online, offline, as you see here, digital twin, NX of the robot, generate G-code, and you control your robot. So the complexity doesn't really increase. What's the benefit? You control the robot without even knowing or having robotic know-how, because it's so easy to do. Um, just think of this. The machine operator today just programs the, the CNC. Tomorrow, he will also program the robot without any additional training, without any additional knowledge. I mentioned some of the tasks, deburring, polishing, milling, that the robot can do. Well, it doesn't stop there. That's just the beginning. The whole pre-drilling, milling, uh, polishing, deburring, engraving. We also can think of, of more complex tasks that the robot can achieve in different branches. If we talk about aerospace branches, we're talking about riveting, tape laying, code surface, where the, where the accuracy is, is even higher. The demand for accuracy from a robot is even higher than, than you might have think that the robot can achieve. Of course, we also are in 3D printing, because why? Additive manufacturing and so others need the robot flexibility. And if there's some takeaway that I want you to take, to take away with you from this presentation, is the key message what we offer with Cinemeric and Run My Robot. 
we offer the unmatched CNC path planning of the machine tool combined together with the flexibility of the robot. That really expands the area of your applications, of what you can do with the robot, and how, how high you can go. So key message, path planning CNC combined with robot flexibility. I hope I aroused your curiosity. I hope you have some questions, some ideas after this presentation, how a robot could be integrated. So I would like to, to meet you here to let you play with the robot, the digital twin of the robot from the C-numeric directly, touch the C-numeric jog, teach the C-numeric, show you the digital twin integration of the robot, and answer all your questions on how the possibilities go. Thank you very much.